Hey everybody, Mike from LA1 here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the Houston Arrows friend GM mode series here at NHL 19. Last time we beat the Houston Arrow, the Dallas Stars with the first ever Battle of Texas. And today we're continuing on with the preseason as we take on the Minnesota Wild. And uh, wow, that look at our look at our in, inside our division. You can see that the Chicago Blackhawks. Actually, no. Let's take a look at it in the first place before we actually get started with tonight's. Uh, not to see stats central. Central division, as you can see, we're in wild card positions right now, and it's, we're outside the wild card on the looking in, along with Nashville and Chicago. So the teams we have to look out for in this series season will be Colorado, Dallas, and of course St. Louis. Meanwhile, the AHL, we're taking a look where, where of course we got, let's see, where is Anchorage at? Anchorage is in the North Division. Why, well, I think we should be in the West, but all right. We probably should have took a look at that. All right, and don't worry, guys, we'll be showing some Anchorage games this season as well. All right, so this game will be against the... Oh, whoops. <laughs> Forgot to switch leagues. We'll be going to be heading to the state of hockey as we take on the Minnesota Wild. All right, we'll be wearing our road whites. Well, Minnesota, we're going to be up doing their jerseys up a little bit. We're going to have them wear their green. Why not? A jersey that I'm sad I know, don't have in my collection. Alright. It's going to be a good game. Hopefully, can the Arrows make this a winning streak? Or we're going to go back to our losing ways? Let's find out. Here we go. As we now enter the barbecue pit of Bruce Boudreaux. As Robin Lehner's in goal for the Houston Arrows tonight, finally, after we're getting our young, are getting our young guys back, and of course, Devin Dubnik will be starting in goal for the Minnesota Wild, and considering the Ducks are blowing it up, literally, by turning points with Adberg for a guy I can't think of at the moment, I don't know what Brian Murray is thinking, man, I feel sorry for true Duck fans. All right, here we go. Here's Nito Niederreiter, a guy I might be looking into picking up for us. Here's Eric Stahl. Stahl back to Dumba. Dumba, the Niederreiter, shoot, save by Laner. Got here's Pat Maroon. Maroon, shot, save by Dubnik, and a stoppage of play. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. There we go. Spurgeon back to Dumba. Dumba back to Nita Ryder. Nita Ryder. Nita Ryder shoots saved by Lehner and a stoppage of play with 6:44 left to go in the first period. Yes, guys, we are being hit with a massive rainstorm. We've been getting slammed by storm after storm after storm the last few days. But thankfully, Friday, I'm hoping to head back into the parks again. So, there's Josh Manson. I could just want to say Pat Maroon. I said, confusing with Manson. Here comes yes, Jesper Fast. Fast. Took a back shot, but there was a Dubnik stop it to play. That was a really lousy pass there, man. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Another one. Well, Face off. I don't know what Placanic is thinking right now. Oh, and gives it to Justin Braun. Braun gives it to Placanic. Placanic will give it to Justin Braun. Braun to Placanic. Shot. Why? Why? Why the net? Dumba. We'll give it. Use it to Placanic. Placanic shoots. Score. Thomas Blacanic 
the veteran leadership of the Houston Arrows, and it is one nothing Houston. With 13.60 left to go, the Arrows get on the board. And it's weird to see Placanic wearing another number other than 14. And it looked like Eric Stahl put it in his own net. Hang on, we're going to have to take a look at that. I I have to take a look at that higher up again. Oh, hey, Nordy. See you at Bailey's birthday party. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. He did! Hold on, there's Stahl. Let's see. Did he touch the puck? Did he touch it? He kind of did, didn't he? Yeah, and uh, hold on. Kind of did. That's that. All right. That, nope. All right. All right, so we're going to take a look at the score sheet here because they're going to, on the ticker, let's see. Placanic, and it is unassisted, so it looks like Stahl will be credited <laughs> with the own goal. Kind of. Here's Zach Parise. Parise shoots, saved by Lehner, and a stoppage of play with 12.39 left to go in this first period. Here's Justin Braun, who will give it to Jesper Fast. Fast shoots, saved by Dubnik. Here's the Duba. Shot. Here's fast, save, rebound, save by Dominic, and a stoppage of play, and I'm really liking this Houston Arrows offense. They are finally getting on the board here. Uh, on the draw, here's Dumba. Dimbo back to Nino Niederreiter. Niederreiter to Parise. Parise to Niederreiter. Saved by Dubnik. Now here comes. Here goes Houston. There's. No, Manson. Manson shoots. Blocked. And there's not. We are under 10 minutes left to go in the first period. Shot. Here's Parise. Parise back to Dumba. Dumba. Parise. Glove saved by Laner. Stoppage of play. Man. All right, here we go. And yeah, we definitely have to work on the face-offs. On the face, Houston wins it. Of course, as soon as I say that, they're going to miss that. Oh, being a rider. Is it a dumba? Dumba, trying to, try to get too fancy, but he just look at the puck. Here's Burgett. Gives it to Stahl. Stahl shoots. Go off stop by, by, by Lehner. Here's Eric Stahl. Who will lose and intercepted by Thomas Placanic. Here's Justin Braun, who gives it back to Placanic. Placanic, who has the only goal in this game so far. Placanic, trying to figure out who to give it to. Gives it to Philip Sedina, and I think that may be a no, no penalty called. And there's going to be a stop coming up here. Shot. There was a blank up play. Here's Jesper Fast. 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 I'm trying to figure out what to do here. Less than three, 3.37 left to go in the first period. Shot to Doomba. Dumba nibs it to Seidenberg. Seidenberg, the coil, sup, wider than that, joking it. And gives it to Delzato. Delzato, here come the arrows. Delzato. Delzato shoots, and apparently, I don't know who, there was Kamarov. To Jordan Wheel, hit the post. It hit the post. Man, this has been some solid hockey right here, folks. One minute left to go in the first period. Coil gives it to Granlund. Granlund to yoking it. Lost side of the puck, but easy save there by Lehner. 
And here we go. We're down to the final seconds here. Seconds left to go here. Delzato blocked by a wild player. And that's going to include the period. At the end of one, Houston, your Houston Arrows lead the Minnesota Wild one to nothing. Man, that was a good period for Houston. And I'm going to get back and get myself a couple of a drink. Be ready to go here. And there's the only goal so far, which apparently was an own goal. And hi, Nordy, we can see you back there. All right, here we go. Second period between the Houston Arrows and the Minnesota Wild. As you can see, look at the shot totals. It has been pretty even. Pretty even. Both teams are playing very smart hockey here today. Here in the state of hockey. All right, here we go. Second period is about to get underway. And the Houston Arrows are underway, and right now it's been pretty much been Minnesota. Robin Lehner has been pretty solid right now. Here's Justin Braun, who will give it to Jasper Fast. Fast. Trying to get it past center ice. He does. He'll give it. He'll, Harold Hagelin will dump it in for some reason. I don't know what. Is they are saying. Here's Nino Nita Ryder. Nita Ryder. Shoot, and it was a misfire. Justin Braun will give it to Jasper Fast to get once again. Fast going right through the neutral zone. Fast the blue line. Fast to Haglin. Saved by Dubinick. Justin Braun, who'll dump it in the zone and spurt him will try and clear it. Minnesota gets it to Eric Stahl. Stahl. He's also going to dump it in. What is going on here? And he gets it to Josh Manson. Manson gives it to Jasper Fast. Fast to Philippe Sedina. Sedina. The Placanic. Save made by Dubinick. And it's a Placanic. Shot saved by Dubnik and a stoppage of play with 14.57 left to go. Man, the arrows have been on the attack throughout this entire map game so far. All right, here we go. Here we go. On the draw here is Justin Braun. Braun will give it. To Zadina. Zadina will give it to Kamaroff. Braun back to Kamaroff. Kamaroff back to Braun. Braun to Manson. Manson shoots wide of the net. It's not here to Charlie Coyle. Coyle. Coyle back to Gramlin. Gramlin back to Clayson. Clayson shoots. Saved by Rayner. Back to Coyle. Back to Seidenberg. Seidenberg. Oh. oh! Hopefully that's not a penalty. No penalty has been called. Good. Got the coil. Why well, I have to release it? Release it. Here's what. The coil. Seidenberg. Oh, what a hit by Leo Kamarop. And here comes Houston. Kamarop. Kamarop shoots. And coil was there before Sedina got to it. Less than 10 minutes left to go in the period. Shot saved by Lehner. And a stoppage of play with 9.38 left to go in the period. And Coyle was right there before Zadina got a chance to get to it. Smart move there. I don't know, Justin Braun. Braun, he's going about the blue line. Braun, trying to find open guy. Braun, shoot, saved by Dubinick, and a stop at the play with 8.40 left to go in the second period. Whew. Man. Uh, Manson, shot, saved by Dubinick, and another stop at the play. On the draw, here's Persian. We'll give it to Dumba. Dumba to Nino Nino Rider. Nino Rider. 
Nina Ryder back to stall. Stall back to Nina Ryder. Save and he nearly got the rebound and it's not there. Here's back Parise. Parise will give it back to Dumba. Dumba to Nina Ryder. A save by Lader. Got the ball set. We'll give it to Josh Manson. Manson. Who is it? Very much Mawson. To Pariabi. Pariabi to Mawson. Oh! Man! And another close call. And here's Nina Nina Ryder. Nina Ryder. Trying to find an open man. Nina Ryder should save by later. Here's Nina Nina Ryder. Block. It was in her, the play was in her fault. Here's Matt Molson. Molson. Here comes Houston. Molson. Trying to get her off. Molson to Pariabi. Pariabi. We'll give it back to Justin Braun. Braun shoots, saved by Dubnik, and there's a stoppage of play. 3.48 left to go in the second period. It is still 1-0 Houston. Man, what a good contest we are having so far here in Houston. Robin Lehner is having a great game so far. All right, here's Dumba. Dumba will give it to Jesse Jokinen. Goes it back to Dumba. Dumba to Jokinen. Shoots! Wad saved there by Dubnik. By, uh, by Laner, excuse me. Gramlin will give it to Jasper Fast. Fast with two minutes left to go in the period. Jasper Fast trying to find somebody. Fast will give it to Haglin. Haglin loses it. Loses it by Gibson shot. Oh, the Placanic! Oh, we nearly had another goal situation there for Houston. One minute left to go in the second period. And here comes Minnesota. Minnesota to Charlie Coyle. Coyle shoots, score! And it is tied up right here, folks. And the lighthouse is smoking as Charlie Coyle ties this game up at one. What? Uh, late, there was no way Laner was going to get that one. Oh. That has to hurt for Minnesota as we are 32 seconds away as Dubnik and Spurgeon will both get credit for the assist. It's going to be interesting to see how the arrows react to this. And now we are approaching the final seconds, and it looks like we are going to go into the third period with a dead heat. Oh, man, if you're... Oh, man, we'll be right back, ladies and gentlemen, after this break. All right, third and final period. This will decide the game, folks. Can Houston come back and retake this lead? Otherwise, this is going to be a rough trip back, back to Houston. All right, here we go. Third and final period of play here, here at the XL Energy Center. And we're on our way. Here's Spurgeon. The man who got the assist on the last goal scored. Here's Spurgeon. Spurgeon shoots, score! And with that, Minnesota has taken the lead. Oh, that hurts for Houston. Uh, Jared Spurgeon. Uh, and you got to feel for Robin Lehner. Come back. All right, here we go. We're back. Oh, man. Let's see how Houston responds here, because right now it's not looking good for Houston. For your Houston Arrows. Here's Eric Stahl. Stahl back to Nita Ryder. Score! And now here we go. And now Minnesota's now down three to one. Oh man, this is not good for Houston fans. As Nito Niederreiter gets his goal, and now 
Oh, man. This is sick. To, this is hard to watch, people. And with that, Houston's down 3-1. to one, And we barely even started. All right, here comes Minnesota. And, oh, and it's out of the stands by Justin Braun. And there's Nordy. Uh, it's probably elated that they scored three unanswered goals on us. All right, here we go. Spurs and, oh, shot. Here's Placanic. Placanic shoots. Saved by Dubinick. And a stoppage of play with 17.42 left to go in the game. Frozen. Go give it to Nino. Nino. Nino Ryder. Nino Ryder. Nino Ryder to stall. Blocked up by Jasper. Jasper fast. Here comes Houston. Jasper fast. Trying to figure. Find what trying to do, and he will dump it in and gets intercepted by Doomba. Doomba to Nino Ryder. Nino Ryder. Nino Ryder gets it to Justin Braun. Braun to Josh Manson. Manson to Braun. Back to Manson. Manson gets it to Haglund. Here comes the arrows. Haglund. Haglund. The Placanic. And trying to give it to Fast, but Spurgeon was right there. Here comes Nino Ryder. Once again, Nino Ryder. Nino Ryder to Dupa. Save by Laner. Braun who will give it to Jesper Fast. Fast shoots, saved by Dubinick, and a stoppage of play with 12.30 left to go in this game. <sighs> and if you're in front of the Toyota Center watching this game, you have got to be frustrated. Now granted, this is the preseason, but giving up three unanswered goals like this is completely unacceptable. Here's Ben Lovejoy. Lovejoy back to Sedina, who has been crushed. Here's Spurgeon. We'll give it to Yossi Jokinen. Back to Spurgeon. Spurgeon. Spurgeon to Coil. Back to Gramlin. Inter intercepted by Sedina. Here comes Philippe Sedina. Sedina, who will give... Sedina, John, and we'll give it to Leo Kamarov. Kamarov shoots! Oh, no, he didn't get the shot off. Dumba. We'll give it to Gremlin. Gremlin to UC Yolkinet. Yolkinet. Gives it to Spurgeon. Sorry, the line changes are going on here. Spurgeon. Spurgeon to Nita Ryder. Shot. Love stayed by Laner. I guess it's a Lovejoy. Lovejoy will give it to Beagle. Beagle. The front line, intercepted by Eric Stahl. Here comes Minnesota again. Stahl to Coil. Turn the side by Laner. Gets it to Beagle. Beagle. Beagle to Matt Lawson. Lawson. Lawson gives it back to Pauliavi. Pauliavi to Braun. Braun shoots. Went wide of the net. Here's Zach Parise. Parise. Less than five minutes left to go. Parise, oh, jeez, and there's a penalty, and that might do it, folks. As Justin Braun will be going into the penalty box, and there's that mistake that could cost this game. How is that? Ah, uh, trippy, my, that did not look like a trippy penalty. Oh, my God. This has been absolutely brutal. Here we go. A penalty kill here, and and I mean, there's no mistake. This game is starting to. So here's Beagle. Jay Beagle. There you go. Gives it to Drew. At the stall. Stall at the Seidenberg. Seidenberg. And he's like to Prosser. Prosser, Danita Ryder. 
in right of the stall score. And yeah, if you put the dagger on this one, folks. Uh. Eric Stahl gets his second preseason goal, and it is a power play goal. Yes, it is. Braun, you are an idiot. Uh. Dang, nabbit. And another L is definitely heading the Houston Arrows way. Uh. Niederreiter and Prosser got the assist, but at this point, there is no way they're going to do this. There is no way they're going to pull a comeback. If there was a comeback, that penalty, that broad penalty killed it. So here's camera off. Camera off the wheel. Junk going in. And they're going to clear it. So the Houston Arrows going to have to figure something quick. After this humiliating defeat to the Minnesota Wild. But now they're going to hit back home. As they get ready to take on a Nashville Predators team. That has underachieved when it matters most in the playoffs. And there's going to be a stoppage of play here. 47.1 seconds left. Oh, man, this has been tough. We ran into a Red Hawk goalie. If it wasn't for... If it wasn't for... Uh, Eric Stahl, we would have had that... We This would have been a shutout. Josh Manson gives it to Jesper Fast. Fast shoots! Saved by Dubinick! And a stoppage of play with 33.2 seconds left. Right on the draw. Jasper Fast gives it to Manson. Manson shoots score! Joss Manson! And I think Hagler got it. And with that, it deficits to two, but I think it might be a bit too little too late. As Carl Hagler will get the goal. His first goal of the preseason. But at least it softens the blow of this defeat. But it won't probably will not be enough. But definitely good good deflection by Haglund. There's no mistake on that goal. And the assist will go to Manson and Fast. But if they can figure out a way to score two goals in less than 30 seconds, I'm going to be impressed if they can figure this out. Here's Blakanic. Empty. But pulling the goalie. Blakanic. The Haglund huge save by Dubnik in the stoppage of play with 18.3 seconds left. <sighs> On the draw, Jesper Fast shoots! Save by Dubnik, we don't score! Uh, and there's two! With 15.3 seconds left. There is still hope, Houston. There is still, there is, there is still hope, Houston. Jasper Fast with his second goal of the preseason, and I don't know, didn't he misplay it? Yeah, yeah, but Dubnik misplayed it. Oh, went off Dubnik skate. It went off Dubnik skate, and with that. If they can get this one more goal, and Thomas Blakanik will get the assist here. One more goal, and this could be a story of the ages here for Houston. And and gives it to Cleason, and I don't think that's going to be enough. Braun shoots, shot, and that is it. Minnesota will narrow away a victory as they defeat Houston 4-3. to For Houston... After giving up those four goals, 
a valiant attempt at a comeback, but as I mentioned previously, this game, that loss was a bit too little too late. Uh, valiant attempt at a comeback by Houston, but in the end, it was a bit too little too late. So a tough loss for Houston, but they they showed they had a bit of a comeback life in them. But now the good news is, as you take a look at three stars, no shock, Minnesota swept. Ugh. But there's some good news for us. For one, we're going back to the Toyota Center, which will be in the next episode, which will probably be Saturday. I don't I don't know. And then they go back. Then they take on. Chicago and Colorado near the end here. So we're going to send to the next preseason game and we're going to end it there. Alright. Let's see how this goes. Oh, owner. Let's take a look. All right. All right, let's see. Why don't we... Prepare, I guess. There we go. Alright, so always we take a look at the standings. Why don't we... Take a look at the standings here as we take a look where we stand right now in the terms of the standings. And as you can see, Houston, Colorado's still at the top, and there's Winnipeg who blew us out. And Minnesota's up there. St. Louis and Dallas are a wild card spot. Meanwhile, we're in the basement in the terms of standings along with Nashville, which this should be a tank bowl, except this is not the NFL at all, coming up right here. And we got Chicago and Colorado next in the preseason. So that's it from here, guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.